Okay. A8 HD. Welcome James! And welcome Classics! Just waiting on um, Maltese. I don't know if Stefano's coming in because it's I don't know if Stefano's about, but he might come on, hopefully. Liam, how are you doing? Yep, um, Classics is already here, we're just waiting on Maltese. Yep, Liam is his real name, I know. There he is, Maltese is in, let's go. what he would be doing right now. This is round one. You'll see two prompts on your device. Answer them any way you want. Each answer will go up against someone else's answer and everyone will vote on which they like most. It's simple. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go!
Today, it's time for some quip lashing. First one, the worst material with which to make a snowman. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. Oh, unlock something it just come up with. Next up, the celebrity you'd eat first if you were a cannibal, and the side dish you'd eat them with. Time to vote. Welcome back, Andy. I don't know what the problem was. Scoreboard. Oh, Cyber Meal Classics at the moment. Time for round two, where everything is worth two times as much as that silly round one. presidential name you can think of that isn't already the name of a president. Okay, pick your favorite. for a sitcom about a bunch of wacky nuns. <laughs> it's voting time. <laughs> and next, a good improvement to make to Mount Rushmore. Vote on your devices. 
James takes the lead. Welcome to the last lash, the final round. Stakes are triple. There's just one prompt, and you're all getting it. Your last lash prompt is a poor substitute for a necktie. this round to spread out any way you like or give them all to one answer. See the final scoreboard. Well done, James. On the first one of the night. Could be it. I don't know where don't think Stefano is about. Right, let's just start. Welcome to Quiplash. Population, you guys. Well, I hope everyone took their shoes off because this game has fairly new carpeting. This is round one. You'll score points based on the percentage of people who prefer your answer. Have at it.
Oh, DVD. Ten seconds, DVD. Ooh, just made it. Let's take a look. The first prompt is the worst charity save the blank. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. Describe your imaginary friend. Vote on your devices. That's round one. Let's take a look at the scores. Oh, Classics takes an early lead. Now round two, where all points and bonuses are doubled. The drama. show. Our first prompt is the unsexiest thought you can have. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. Something the devil is afraid of. Vote on your devices. <laughs> Sequel to Titanic, if there were one. Titanic 2, blank. Time. 
Time to vote. Gryffindor, Ravenclaw, Slytherin, and Hufflepuff. But what's the Hogwarts house few have ever heard of? Vote on your devices. <laughs> Two, fire up the scoreboard. Oh, Maltese takes the lead. Even though you didn't get it, he still took the lead. This is round three, the last lash. One final chance to catch up. Point values are tripled, and everyone gets the same prompt this time. Our prompt is. The futuristic invention you can't wait to see exist. Give out your votes now. Final scores. And Maltese does it. Well done, Maltese. So that's one for DVD, one for Maltese. B E V J. Uh, me classics Maltese and James <laughs> Right, okay, let's start didn't show up again. Now let's do this anyway. Time for round one. You score based on the percentage of players who like your answer. Plus, there are winner's bonuses at stake. Go!
Oh, okay. Okay, it's time for some quip lashing. Starting things off, pick any city name and make it sound dirty. Okay, pick your favorite. Another use for tampons. <laughs> it's voting time. <laughs> okay, next one. A realistic, honest fast food slogan. To vote. <laughs> Round one is in the books. Let's see the scores. Oh, classics takes the lead. Two time and to make it interesting, I'm doubling all the point values. You heard me. Future. Robocop actually retires from the police force and becomes Robo Blank. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. entry in Gary Busey's dream journal tonight I dreamed blank time to vote thing you can airbrush on your van. It's voting time. Monkeys hate blank. Time to vote. <laughs> Round 
round two is now complete. Let's see who completed it well. Moon yeah. Classics is still in the lead. And now round three, the last lash. Point values are tripled and you'll all be answering the same prompt this time. The last lash prompt is... A fun trick to play on the boat. It's over. Let's take a look at the final scores. And Classics wins it. Well done, Classics. So you've all won one now. The next one will be the decider. It might be the last one, next, the next game. I C R J. Yes, let's go. Hey, -o, I'm Josh Schmitzenstein, but you can call me Schmitty. Also, you may call me Schmitty. Wow, there is a really weird energy in this room. Let's just try to get through this, okay? This is round one. You'll score points based on the percentage of people who prefer your answer. Have at it.
Oh, 10 seconds. Who is it? It's Morsese. 10 seconds. Oh, he just made it. Okay, here we go. First one. Survival tip. Start a fire by rubbing blank. Okay, ah! go for your favorite. They really found in King Tut's tomb. Vote on your devices. <laughs> Next in line. A really odd thing to say on your deathbed. Time to vote. Okay, next one. Make up a name for a silent film porno from the 1920s. It's voting time. <laughs> That's the end of round one. Let's take a look at the scores. Morty's and James. Yeah, Morty and James at the and moment. All points are doubled. Time for some quick lashing. First up, the most stereotypical country song title. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. The scariest animal in the world is the blank cobra. Oh, <laughs> come on! Same thing. <laughs> well, that's fortunately got one inch. And next is what robots dream about. Time to vote.
Next one, the best part about being Donald Trump. Vote on your devices. <laughs> Let's take a look at the scores. Ooh, Multis and Classics now. And James is still in there. This is round three, the last lash. Points are tripled and everyone gets the same one single prompt this time. Your prompt is... A lesser known knight of the round table, Sir Blank. Everybody's in. Vote with your votes now. That's it. Let's take a look at the final scores. Yeah. And Maltese is 1 2. Well done, Maltese. Tell you what, we'll have one more game. We'll have one more game. Uh, we'll just stick with the same part. Let's go with it just in case someone does turn up. One more game, and that'll be it for the night. B I M I hey. Yep, yeah, one more and that'll be it for the night. Right, I think we're all in, no one else is around. Right, let's go. Hi there, I'm your host, Schmidt, and I'm kind of excited to be here. Remember guys, during this game, it's natural to fall in love with me. Fight the feeling. Let's go. This is round one. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go!
let's take a look. Our first prompt is, little known fact, over the course of a lifetime, an average person accidentally eats 10 blank. Okay, pick your favorite. Boring video game. It's voting time. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, next one. Time to vote. <laughs> Next in line, the name of a toilet paper specifically designed for the Queen of England. Vote on your devices. <laughs> That's round one. Let's take a look at the scores. Oh, Classics takes the lead. On to round two, where all points are doubled. Doubled, I say. Start the show. The first prompt is So, what was that movie Birdman about anyway? Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. original speech said, ask not what your country can do for you, ask blank. Time to vote. Is the Tower of Pisa lean? It's voting time. <laughs> I 
Coming up next, fun thing to do if locked in the mall overnight. Load on your devices. End of round two. Let's see what happened. Ooh, take my lead! Oh, oh, it's first tonight. This is round three, the last lash. One final chance to catch up. Point values are tripled, and everyone gets the same prompt this time. Our last lash prompt is. Name the eighth dwarf who got cut at the last minute. your votes Let's see the final scoreboard. Oh, Classics just won! Well done, Classics. Well done. Almost got one tonight. Almost. Anyway, guys, I'm going to call it a night here. Thank you for coming on. It's been fun again. Take care of yourselves. Um, Stefano will be doing his stream tomorrow, so hopefully I'll see you on St Stefano's stream tomorrow. Take care and.